The early Devonian therefore had a very different diversity of plants than is found today. There was not a single flowering plant, not a flowering tree, not a blade of grass, no flowers. There were no gymnosperms, there were no seed ferns, an extinct group, and so thus there were no seed plants at all. There were no ferns, there were no trees, there were no bushes. The plants of the early Devonian consisted of a number of primitive non-vascular plants, some like mosses and liverworts, and some a bit more closely related to the vascular plants. There were a number of primitive vascular plants which could grow to be taller, but which lacked true roots and true leaves. There were some which seemed to be more closely related to the seed plants and ferns, and there were some true lycopods which had true leaves and roots known by at uh, this point in Earth's history. So there would have been a great diversity of plant types, although they mostly would have been shorter plants probably growing in more aquatic habitats. Because most lacked roots, many depended on a symbiotic relationship with mycorrhizal fungi, in which the fungi grew in association with sprawling stems and gathered nutrients which then the plants could make use of. Although no trees existed on planet Earth during the early Devonian, there was an organism which could reach 8 meters in height, about 24 feet. It is thought to have been a fungus, although there have been a variety of interpretations. It now seems to have been an enormous fungus, which could grow to be 8 meters tall and 1 meter uh, in width. This probably would have been the fruiting structure, and that the individual organism would have consisted of a huge mat of mycelia, the microscopic strands which compose the fungus, which would have grown in the soil. This organism is called Prototaxites. Its name literally means early yew, although we know clearly it is not a yew nor a conifer, but rather seemingly a fungus. It is known through the Silurian, through the Upper Devonian periods in Earth's history, a period of about, say, from 420 million years ago to 370 million years ago. It was distributed all throughout Earth and would have been the largest organism of the planet during most of its time.